So today I'm handling a very interesting topic. Ai! Ai nimefurai! Nimefurai! I'm so excited! Today I want us to establish why is it that Kenyan women love wababas? Mbona mnapenda wababas? Mbona mnapenda nga wababas? Mbona, mbona, mbona. Who are the wababas? When somebody tells you that akona mubabas, what does it mean? Then I come back akona mubabas. Zana manisha nini? Like what is she talking about? Wababas. These are men who are above thirty years. So if you are below thirty years, you are disqualified to become a mubabas. A man who is above 30 years qualifies to become a mbaba. Number two, they are financially stable. Kama umesota, hata kwa 30 years, you are not a mbaba. A mbaba is somebody who is about 30 years, financially stable. Either married or not. Either married or not. It does not matter. You are either married or not. You're qualified to be a mbabas. And the last thing, they love instant fun. Wababas, wanapenda ra, wanapenda ra, 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 ra. So guys, <coughs> here are the reasons why Kenyan women, why Kenyan women love and cherish and want and prefer wababas. They are financially stable. Guys, let me tell you a story. <clears throat> In the jungle, the lion is the king of the jungle. So all the lands in the jungle belong to who? The lion. Gazelles. Gazelles love to eat grass. We all know gazelles. They love to eat grass. They depend on grass to survive. So what the lion does is it gives, it gives space for the gazelle to come and eat from its land and let it enjoy the land and eat the grass from its land and later on the lion comes and eats the gazelle <laughs> however you interpret this story is totally up to you psychology has deducted that women what women crave more in a relationship it's security even before love. Like Dema Kikuja kwa in a relationship, the only thing that she thinks that she wants to have that to be financially secure. Financially secure. That's why they go for wababas because you dema taka kiamuka subui, atoke ya kwa mkia subui, ande kwa jikoni, a pasue maya yazake tatu, akule na mkate, na chai ya maziwa si strong tea. Eh, hey, strong tea ya nini. Atoke ya achukuliwe na gari, akwe na gari yake. Atoke hapo aende kazi, aende kazi afike pale kazi, aingie kwa ofisi, afanye kazi, atoke hapo achukuliwe na gari because she is wearing a very expensive dress. Atoke pale abebwe or she should be taken out for a late night evening supper or should I say dinner? Supper ni hao, watu wana pesa, dinner ni watu wana kuna pesa. There's a big difference. Ukisema okay, unatafuta supper, dinner ni watu wana kuna pesa, supper ni watu wamesota. So ukisikia, okay, boys waka nasema kuja tukule supper, uju ya mesota, but akisema let's go for dinner. Pia kuna pesa, big difference. Back to what I was saying, that's what women want. Women want a lavish lifestyle. Eh? Women want to be financially secure. They want to do their manicures and pedicures with peace. And, uh, one thing in Yamujui is that these wababas, one thing they have, that wewe, wewe unaniangalia hauna pesa. Wababas have this mukwanja pesa. That's why women will go for them because this Wababas will provide for them pesa and wababas are wananga shida na kupeana pesa because that's what they do because there's something they are looking for. So mnaijua, I don't want to talk about it. Kila mtu anajua mbona wababas wanapeananga pesa because they are looking for something. Rule number 1 if you want to become a mbabas intaka na kuwa na do. You need to have money. You need to be financially stable to become a mbabas and uh, because this will make you be attractive to more women. In fact, those young women those beautiful women, they will come for you because you have money, 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 money. On to point number two. They find them mature. Science has proven that men have an 11 year lag behind women when it comes to maturity. This is to mean that men become emotionally mature 
by the age of 43 years old. While women become emotionally mature by the age of 32 years, it's not me. If you mean to my name on science, go and read the books, they will tell you that women have an 11 year gap. 11 year, like a woman when you come like kama say if you are 20 years old and you are, you are dealing with a lady when you are 20 years old, that lady is emotionally mature than you by 11 years. What? That is why it explains this. Do you know that ladies by the age of 20 years, eh, most of them know the kind of man they want to marry, the kind of house they want to live in, the kind of wedding dress they will wear, how many children they want. Alafu kuna wanaume hiyo wakati wa 20 years old. Hiyo wakati ni kucheza FIFA tu. Maluza, loser pay, wako kwa place ya FIFA, shere. That's why a lady who is at 20 years old will be more attracted to a guy who is at uh, 31 years old. That's why they go for wababas because they find them mature. And let me say just a guy, a lady who is in the same bracket as you. Ana kuonanga kama mtoto. Siko kupenda, chatu ni wambio kweli. Ana kuonanga nyi kama watoto because he finds you not mature. Ana kuona nyi like bado ni watoto, you have not grown up. And then he looks at those guys when you older older than her, who are in the 30s and say like, oh damn, Cristiano Ronaldo, oh Diamond, oh Kiana Di Marisa. That's why they are attracted to those who are babas. Eh? So men, relax, relax. Kama utakwi, Ephraia, you have found knowledge kujua kuwa, si kupenda kuwa, kwa ni science. So utapishana na science. Utapishana na science. Will you break the cycle? Will you break the cycle? Eh? Relax, be yourself. Be yourself. Jijiamini, ni kubad. On to point number 